Hello guys, welcome to today's video by Troy Stanley and this is a TS Tech Talk video. On today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to um, set your default applications on your device. Now, the reason why I'm setting this default application is most times you might mistakenly change your default um, um, browser or default media player or default um, PDF reader or word reader. So whichever application it is. But on today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to change your default browser on your Android phone. Let's dive into that. I'm doing this on a Samsung phone and this should work for mostly every Android phone. Now, um, let's go over to the settings section, which I am currently looking for right now. So, um, this is the settings section. Click on settings and it should be on the um, Android section. So, um, um, Android app manager or app manager. So, I'm going to click on apps right here. So, if you have um, uh, uh, um, app manager is the same thing. And on this top area, click on this three dotted icon and then click on default app. Now, um, if you click on default app, it's going to display all of the default app. And this is actually the main reason why I'm doing this because most times whenever I click a link, I expect it to open on Google Chrome browser, but it opens on CryptoTab browser. That is because I have Crypto CryptoTab browser running on my device and I changed it actually by myself. So if you want to change this, just click on this particular application and choose the browser that is displaying. I'm actually going to choose this and I'm going to leave it as default. You can actually make use of um, Internet Explorer that is if you if that is what you want. So when you're done, just go ahead and navigate back. So if for some reason you want to change Google Assistant, click on this area and then click on the app. But there is no other um, Google Assistant installed on your phone. So this is the only one active. That is the reason why you are only going to see this Google because that is the only um, assistant on your mobile device. And also if you have um, other app launcher, you are going to see them all here. So choose the default one or the one you prefer. And I think everything is okay. And also on the SMS section, you can choose your default SMS. Most people actually make use of um, Facebook Messenger as their default SMS, which I don't think is cool. I think using in, um, the, the inbuilt SMS is actually very okay. So um, this is actually all I want to show you guys on today's video. If there is any issue, um, please leave it on the comment section. Or if there is any other thing you want to ask, leave it on the comment section. And also, this is the only phone um, call application we have on our device. And most times there can be Google contacts and you can have Google contacts on this phone, but actually I do not have it installed. So I'm okay with this particular one inbuilt by Samsung. So this is all I want to show you guys on today's video and I hope it's helpful. If this is helpful, please do not forget to smash like and subscribe to the channel for more video. I will see you guys on my next video. Please stay safe and peace.